thought I was, he thought I sucked. He thought I sucked. He thought oh. I sucked. But really, like, and when I explained to him that I wasn't a composition major, he said, well, I see why, but that doesn't mean you need to be a composer now. You're not ready. Oh, so I mean, he, he tore me up, and I took it. I took it like a man. So finally, one day, he said, you know what? You need to just stay in, he said, just do production, man. Just, just do that. Do that. Don't do this composition thing. Just stop. So I did a composition recital because I was trying to get in Temple University. And I, the year I was working with him, I was studying under him. He, he gave me a few kind of nods, like, hmm, that's interesting, that's nice. So I did a composition recital to get into Temple University because they wanted recordings of your compositions. Understand, I am not in a composition program. I'm not mm. studying composition. Everything I'm doing, I'm pulling players together, pulling musicians together, writing music for them, even, even pulling some of my professors in to sing and play stuff. This is all extra credit, right? All because mm. I need to record for Temple University to get into their master's program. So Adolphus Hellstork came to my recital. And when it was over, he said, I didn't know you played the piano like that. He was like, all this stuff is going on. He, he said, all this is going on in your little brain. He said, you're going to be all right. I said, I think I just, <laughs> for real? Wow. But guess what? This is funny. I got accepted into Temple University. Okay? Yeah. Let's just say it was May. I got accepted. Beginning of June, they send me another letter and say, our apologies, we sent that first letter to you by accident. You have not been accepted in Temple University. Oh, no. 